I love it up here because of the environment, the people, the, the recreation, the hunting, the fishing. Everything about Grand Rapids is awesome. Hi, my name is Dave Johnson. I live in Grand Rapids, Minnesota, and I voted Republican Donald Trump. My name is Harvey Craig, and I live at Bay Drive, Minnesota City, and I am a Republican. Rural communities are no different than other communities when it comes to bringing a polarizing topic. In fact, in many cases, they hold more opportunity for this. Years ago, uh, when I heard of climate change, I would just shrug it off. I was a semi-driver, and I had a lot of time in the semi, which I would turn on Rush Limbaugh. He changed my mind. I thought it was all a farce until the Rural Climate Dialogues contacted me and I was a part of the forum that they presented that changed my mind. The Rural Climate Dialogues are a revolutionary form of engagement in rural communities. So I first heard about the Rural Climate Change Dialogues um, through a postcard. Through a card that I got in the mail. Yeah, it, it was a call out ad and it was, it was intriguing for me. We started off by coming into a room um, and they had a U-shaped line of table set up. I, I really thought it was kind of like a, a, a trial. So the citizens jury, which is the central point of engagement around the rural climate dialogue model, is a three-day intensive gathering of community citizens. So the way that they went about it was having individuals sit down and listen to presenters on certain topics. We speak about uh, stress on livestock or stress on crops, stress on our transportation and energy systems or our public health system. And so we initiate by showing evidence, talking about consequence, and then initiating conversations about the things that are important to local communities. And then afterwards we would break out into small group conversations as a way of digesting the information from all these different perspectives and points of view. What it allows is the space for the community to arrive at their viewpoint around climate change together. Well, I, I went into the climate dialogue with reservations and I came out of there with a passion for trying to help change our environment. I knew I had to have an open mind and I could not be what I was before I came into this and it definitely changed my mind. This isn't really something that should be Democrat versus Republican. It should be an all, all around humanity embrace. It's almost a must that people see this. People need to go through the experience that I went through. Yeah, I think climate change can impact a lot of people with their votes. If once the people start to understand how serious climate change is, So following these climate dialogues, what I'm absolutely certain of is that there isn't a topic that's too polarizing, too political to bring into communities. There's just insufficient forms of engagement.